Well, let's talk about the weather and really not a bad Sunday, Kelly. It was nice for the game and for the 12,500 fans who were able to go inside. They had the roof open, right? And we did have a few sprinkles earlier this morning, right. but really didn't have a big impact for most of the day. Yeah, so what are we looking at moving forward? Definitely some rain. Yes, and tomorrow looks to be pretty wet and damp and Pretty chilly too. Here's a look at live Doppler 13 radar. We do have a couple of complexes, one well to our north, but the one we're watching out for is the one that is moving currently over St. Louis. This is going to be moving right along I-70, bringing some downpours, perhaps even a few isolated thunderstorms is what we have going on right now. But this is moving about 60 miles per hour. So the distance at this point will bring it to the Indianapolis area around 815, 830-ish. So we'll be watching out for that. It'll likely make its way into the Indiana state border though in West Central Indiana around 715. So here's a look at the temperatures right now. A little cooler in Northwest Central Indiana where the winds have already shifted out of the Northwest behind the cold front that's moving in. 58 in Richmond right now, 65 in Bloomington at 62 in Indianapolis. Here's a look at those winds. Those winds have shifted here. You can really see where that cold front is and it's going to continue to move into the area and that boundary is going to be triggering these showers maybe a thunderstorm or two, but temperatures will fall into the low 50s later this evening with scattered showers around, especially after 8 o'clock tonight. Here's a look at future track. It speeds us up a bit, so keep that in mind. It's moving a little faster than what we have actually happening, but notice a lot of the heavier rain will stay along in south of I-70 throughout tomorrow morning. I think most of this will be out of here around 8, 9 o'clock tomorrow morning. But this is the first round. We'll stay cloudy and cool throughout the day tomorrow. In fact, wind chill values will make it feel like it's in the upper 30s and low 40s. Here's a look at rain totals as we head through tomorrow mid morning. We could see the heavier downpours again along in south of I-70, anywhere from a half an inch, possibly over an inch of rain. Certainly lighter amounts in northwest central Indiana, but again, we'll take what we can get. Now, here's a look at future track as we go through mid morning into the afternoon. We may see a couple more rounds of showers as the boundary it kind of wobbles back and forth across central Indiana, bringing us chances of rain throughout the day. It is going to be a cool day. Temperatures tomorrow afternoon only climbing into the mid 50s, but again, it's going to feel much cooler than that. We are going to see a warm up, however, though. Tuesday, We'll bring in a chance of some rain mainly later Tuesday night into Wednesday morning. 62 the high Tuesday. We're back into the low 70s on Wednesday. Check out Thursday. Really will be the pick of the week. Sunny and dry. Highs in the upper 70s. We have rain chances again on Friday afternoon. Before that front moves in, though, we'll still climb to 75.